Hey everybody, I was reading Matthew 25, 35 through 36 recently. For I was hungered, and ye gave me meat. I was thirsty, and ye gave me drink. I was a stranger, and ye took me in. Naked, and ye clothed me. I was sick, and ye visited me. I was in prison, and ye came unto me. While I was reading it, it struck me how personal a directive that it is. He's not saying that people should care for the hungry, naked, sick, imprisoned, and strange, generally speaking. He's speaking to us. He's saying, you, you do these things. You feed the hungry. You quench the thirsty. You take the stranger. You clothe the naked. You care for the sick. You visit the imprisoned. That is what being a Christian comes down to. The previous verses mention how people will be separated into goats and sheep, when the Son of Man shall come in his glory, and all the holy angels with him. Then shall he sit upon the throne of his glory, and before him shall be gathered all nations, and he shall separate them one from another, as a shepherd divideth his sheep from the goats. And he shall set the sheep on his right hand, but the goats on the left. Then shall the king say unto them on his right hand, Come, ye blessed of the Father, inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. His sheep are the ones who will have taken care of the forgotten and the marginalized. They won't be the ones who shouted loudest against gay marriage or immigration or welfare programs. They won't be the ones who baptized the most converts. They won't be the ones who judged it the harshest, those who drank coffee or shopped on Sundays. Now the question is whether I'm doing the things that he expects of me, one who claims to follow him. If you agree with the points I raised in my video, give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below why. If you disagree with my the points I raised in my video, give me a thumbs down and let me know in the comments below why. As well, please subscribe and share my video. I look forward to talking to you again soon.